Hey, hi, hello, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm currently trying to put my greasy hair in a slicked back ponytail. And I think I'm kind of successful, at least from how it looks in the front. My part is a little messed up, but that's fine. Um, okay, I'm gonna put on a little light makeup because I need to go get my nails done because they are so grown out and this one's like kind of popping off and you know like when you run your fingers through your hair and like your hair gets caught in your nail like that's when you know it's time to get a fill so that's what we're gonna go do today and i have a bunch of other stuff planned so this is gonna be a fun little vlog i'm meeting one of my good friends for dinner tonight her name's sonia you guys are gonna get to meet her she is so sweet i haven't seen her in like forever so i'm really excited we're gonna go get sushi and do a little shopping I think this is gonna be like one of my last vlogs at home. I moved back to Charlotte in two weeks, which is honestly crazy. So I'm really excited to do like a move-in video, like a room tour video, like it's gonna be really fun. All right guys, here's the fit. We are ready to go. Even though I'm convinced I look like an egg. I hate slick back hairstyles, Loki because it reminds me of when I used to dance and when we had to have like a slick back middle part, like ponytail or bun. So it just reminds me of those times, which I mean were fun, but also weren't kind of fun for me. But the hair is extremely greasy today. We are gonna shower though. We're gonna take an everything shower, but yes. Anyways, here's the fit, let's go. I honestly feel like recently, every time I vlogged, I've always been going to the nail salon last week or two weeks ago was my toes and now this week it's my nails um so we're gonna go get those fixed um what else i have to come home i have to eat and then we're gonna get all cute and dolled up to go meet sonia we're going to this place in raleigh called north hills there's a cowfish up there which is really cute and then there's a little shopping plaza near there so we're gonna go shop get some sushi and just have a really good time and I'm really excited to vlog that guys Sonia is one of my best friends she's one of the prettiest people you will ever meet and she is also one of the sweetest people you will ever meet very eventful day planned and I'm really excited to you guys along I will see you guys when we get there to get these nails fixed oh literally so flipping good okay I just got out of the nail salon funny story I went to the place where I usually go to when I'm home but it was literally an hour wait and I did not have that much time on my hands. So I went to this place across the street and they actually did such a good flipping job, like much better than what I'm used to. Okay, I just got done with lunch. I had a yummy egg with some avocado toast. It was delish. I'm about to hop in the shower. Um, so if you're a girl, you know that like an everything shower can take up to like an hour and a half. So even though I probably don't need to leave here until... 4 30 to meet with Sonia I'm probably gonna hop in the shower at like 2 30 because I also have to do like my hair my makeup and everything but I want to show you guys what my outfit options are for tonight okay here is the dress she is super cute like I said has the slits on the side this is exactly how I'm gonna wear it with my Nike socks um I think she's so cute especially in the back and it shows a little bit of my tattoo which I love the only thing is that it's gaping a little bit on the side which I don't know how to fix that this is option number two it's really top like it's really flattering um in the top like the girlies are girlying but the bottom like I don't know how much I like I thought it'd just be like a little bit more like body calm but then I see like I don't know how much I love it like flaring outside of my bootay um so I don't know maybe maybe not Okay, option number three, I will say that this is my second favorite, um, opposed to the dress. The only thing is that I do have a strapless bra on, but I'm afraid you might be able to see it, like, through the seam. I don't know, and I don't want to, like, photograph in that, if that makes sense. And then you can kind of see a little bit of the strapless bra right here. Like, I'm just trying to, like, get her fixed up. Um, but yeah, definitely... Another one of my fave options with the McQueens. I think it'll look really cute. Um, also, I'm bringing like a tiny bag and I don't know if I'm gonna bring my camera, but if I do, I'll need a pocket to put my phone in and this will do. So, yeah. 
I just got out of my everything shower. I feel so clean, so refreshed. Now we're gonna do makeup and then I'm debating whether or not I wanna curl my hair or give myself a blot with the Dyson. I probably should have underlined my eyes before I curled my lashes. Good job, Kaylee. If I have to recurl my lashes, I will, but right now I'm just like tight lining my um, eyelid with this black Mario eyeliner. Okay, I don't think those look bad. Uh, some of my eyelashes probably came out in that process, but it's fine. I'm actually gonna finish up the rest of my eye makeup first. I'm taking my favorite bronzer ever. This is the Charlotte Tilbury one and putting that as just kind of like my overall like eyelid color. And then I'm taking my favorite little MAC shadow and mainly putting this in the outer corner of my eyes. I'm gonna add a little wing and sparkle shadow towards the end of my makeup routine. But now I'm going to put on mascara. I don't actually coat like all of my lashes with mascara. I just put them on the ends. Okay. Eye makeup. Really simple, but really cute. We might have to touch her up in a little bit. Now we're going to store on my base. I'm going to mix the Kosas Glow IV with this Glossier Skin Tint. I recently just got this. If you guys don't have the Glossier Skin Tint, you are missing out on life. It's so good. Just taking this Say Brush to blend it all in. So some of you might have noticed that I literally archived my entire Instagram. And the reasoning behind that is because I've hated the way that my Instagram has looked for like the past two years. Like, I just feel like my Instagram is literally all over the freaking place. Like there's nothing cohesive about it. And I've always wanted like a cohesive Instagram feed. So I finally bit the bullet and was like, you know what? We are starting from scratch. That's why I'm really excited to take pictures tonight because this is going to be like the first pick on my feed that's gonna like set the tone for this new vibe that I'm trying to go for. If any one of my friends knows how to take bomb ass pictures, it's literally Sonia. So she's like the perfect person to help me pick a new photo or like a series of photos that's gonna like rebrand my Instagram. I haven't used this in forever, but this is the Charlotte Tilbury contour wand. I've also taken a little pause on modeling. So I don't know if you guys remember, but back when I was like kind of like partially active-ish on YouTube, I was signed with a modeling agency that was in New York, but they moved to Atlanta. You guys know that I am very honest with you guys and I'm only ever going to be my authentic self on this channel. But to be honest, I kind of am struggling with my weight a little bit right now. And I know a lot of people were like, oh my god, Kaylee, like, no, you look so great. You look beautiful. And I appreciate that and I love all of you, but it's just like, I don't feel as confident as I think I can be in my body right now. So moral of the story is I'm just trying to work on myself and better myself. For the longest time, I felt like I've always put other people before myself. Part of the reason is because I am a people pleaser, okay? I want to make everyone happy and feel good. And I know that's like absolutely impossible, but in doing that, I've kind of lost sight of putting myself first. So over this summer, I have flipped the coin and I am finally focusing on myself and trying to better myself. It feels so good to finally be able to put myself first and focus on me. Okay, Sonia actually just texted me and said jeans and a top. So that is what we are going to do. I'm excited now. <laughs> but yes, for a while now, I genuinely feel like I've kind of been not satisfied with the way that I've been living, if that makes sense. I feel like there's so much more I could be doing right now to better me and better myself, and I'm finally taking those actions to do so. That got deep really quickly. Sorry, y'all. Um, <laughs> but like I said, like I only ever want to be honest with you guys on this channel. And if any of you guys are going through it right now, my comment section is always open if you want to talk or if you need advice. Because when I first started YouTube, my end goal was to provide people with a space where they could wholeheartedly and authentically be themselves and feel safe. And that is still my goal while I'm restarting my YouTube channel. On a different note, this blush is so flippin' pretty. It's the Makeup by Mario, the Makeup by Mario one in the shade Pale Petal. Guys, if you could only see my bathroom counter right now. Like, I have a pretty decent sized bathroom counter, but when the makeup comes out, it's just whoosh, flooded. I haven't done a wing in a hot minute. I hope I'm still good at it. I take this little angled brush and I just get a little product on there. See, just a little tiny one, okay? Now pray to the eyeliner gods that we can do it the same way on the separate side. Okay, that's good. I don't wanna mess with it. We're also gonna do a little shimmer, my favorite. I haven't done like a heavier makeup look in a while. So I hope this turns out okay. The holy grail of blushes, Dior. 
Okay, let's blow out. Oh wait, I almost forgot a final round of setting spray. Okay, we're gonna go blow out my hair and I'll check back in with you guys when we pick an outfit. I forgot how flipping good a Dyson blow out is. Oh, okay, slide. So we went with the top and the jeans. I'll show you all the fit in a second, but for right now we need to do a lip combo. I'm gonna use the Refi um, lip liner in the shade Rosewood. I'm putting on the Dior lip oil, but in my bag, I'm gonna put the Summer Fridays lip butter balm. Okay, I'm gonna touch up my makeup and then we need to be out the door. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I feel like a complete bad bitch right now. Don't mind the mess, but I mean, hello. She is so ready, here's the fit. Skims, Levi's, Alexander McQueen's. I don't think I'm gonna bring my camera to North Elsa vlog just cause like it's outdoors and I don't want someone to snatch it. So we are going to be switching to the phone for the rest of the vlog. Oh, I'm so excited. We're gonna go get sushi, go to Sephora. So you guys know I'm gonna do a haul. I am obsessed with this look. I forgot how good the Dyson air app is. Okay guys, this is so yeah. I'm on. <laughs> so much. <laughs> Alright guys, we just got our food. Look at how yummy this is. It looks so good. I'm obsessed. Alright guys, so we just wrapped up a cowfish. Um, we're gonna take pics because I deleted like all my Instagram pics and I need new ones. Um, so yes, and then we're gonna go shopping. Mwah. Okay, we're currently in my favorite store ever. In Sephora. <laughs> I'm currently getting the Hourglass like lip balm in the shade Scents. Um, I also want a new brow gel, so we're gonna go look for that. We got the goodies. <laughs> if you guys can't tell, Sonia has the best makeup in the game, and no. she's so gorgeous. So I asked her for some makeup advice, and literally like two out of the three things that I bought were Sonia's recommendations. So. Guys, we're in PacSun, and I thought I'd just show this to the vlog. I didn't know this. Sonya didn't know this. I didn't. But they sell Princess Polly in PacSun now. She, she is so cute. <laughs> All right, guys, we got more goods. I am so excited to show you guys the haul, even though you kind of already know what I got from Sephora, but I definitely put a little bit of a dent on my bank account, but it's okay, because I've been working hard. So, cheers to me. Okay, guys, so Sonya wanted to come check out my new car. So cool. Obsessed with it. Um, we're currently in the parking lot of the mall, but we're gonna head our separate ways. We had such a fun day. I love Sonia so much. I miss <laughs> you so much. <laughs> it was so fun catching up with each other, but I will see you guys back at home. We're gonna do a little haul of what I got, and then we're we'll gonna see each other in two weeks. Yes, we go back to Charlotte in two weeks, which is crazy. And we're actually we're not living together, but we're living in the same like complex. So we're gonna be like I think like a yeah, I think like a five minute walk from each other, yeah. which is really fun. You guys are gonna be seeing a lot more of Sonia on my vlogs, okay? Oh my okay, say bye, Sonia. Bye. <laughs> I just got back from the mall with Sonia, but anyway, we had a really fun time. I changed into some comfy clothes. I still need to take off like all of my jewelry, but I'm gonna do a little mini haul. So they sell Brandy Melba packs on, and I intended on getting these tank tops, but the tank tops I wanted they didn't have in store. So I'm just adding to my hoodie collection. I got a big gray. New York hoodie that I'm really excited to wear. It's so big I cannot even fit it in the entire camera frame, but it's so comfy, it's so cozy. I've had a lot of these hoodies and crewnecks before and I just, I love them and they're so oversized. So this is the only thing I got from PacSun. And then from Sephora, I kind of showed y'all what I got a little bit, but more in depth. I already opened this one and used this, but this is the Hourglass Phantom Volumizing Glossy Lip Balm. And I got it in the shade Sense. It's really pretty, I have it on right now, and I think it looks great. The next thing I got was the 24 hour brow setter. I have been trying to find a new brow gel for a really long time. I like the Anastasia one, but it's starting to like pill around my eyebrows and it's just like coming off in like little flakes and that's not a cute look. So I'm excited to try this one. And then finally, Sonia recommended this to me. I got the Laura Mercier setting powder because I, you know, put on concealer and I do the Kosas powder, but I feel like my concealer wears off by the end of the night. So shout out to Sonia for these two recommendations. I'm really excited to try them. Okay, I'm going to go do my nighttime routine, take off my jewelry and my makeup, and I will check back in with you guys before I go to bed. All right, guys, we are fresh face, no makeup, nighttime skincare routine is on. 
I'm just gonna go read my book and get in bed because I had so much fun today and it was low-key exhausting. <laughs> um, we were out for a really long time, so I honestly don't know when my next video is going to be, um, especially because I'm moving back to Charlotte, back for college. I would say no more than two weeks though. Um, I will definitely keep you all updated on my socials. If you don't follow me on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, you totally should. It's all in the link in the description. Okay, that sounded so like YouTuber of me. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I love you so much and I will see you guys very soon with another video. Bye.